This is all the all the secret stuff. I'm not telling. Uh, I'm not telling Tanner some of the real secret stuff. We already oh, know that. It's he's, already he's hoarding it. Yeah, it's already in the truck. We don't use live bait. Me and Cage don't use, don't use live bait. They're live. They're dead. <laughs> <laughs> Touché. 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 Thank you very much. Look at all this stuff. There it is. Thank you, man. All for a lake trout. All for the lake trout. Oh my, oh my god. god. What is this? Yes. <laughs> yes. yes. The way he walked <laughs> out was so good. Don't no worry, we made one for you guys too. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> like, come here. Just turn around. Turn around. Okay, welcome to my cribs. Main kitchen dining area. For necessities, bread, bananas, beer, mustard. In that order? What more do you need? In that order? Or is it? When we walk in, here's the master bathroom. Yeah. Someone, uh, someone used it. <laughs> <laughs> we have another bathroom. No one's used this one yet. Maybe queen on the bottom and a twin on top. How? That's innovative. This is Sukasa Aqua Traction for the week. Um, stay tuned for everything that's going to be going on. We're hecka, hecka excited. Hecka all excited? Hecka excited. What does that even mean? <laughs> I don't even know, but we're going to roll with it all week. Hecka. So the guys from North Dakota gave me a call and we were just going through and just trying to figure out some different, different areas of the country. We thought it'd be really cool to get some good marketing videos done and, and show off the product. You know, through the grapevine, we learned that our odds of getting a much, much bigger fish was going to take place out on Flathead Lake. Lake trout, like that just builds anticipation right from the start. N nothing's really known about it. I mean, besides once you get up here, you see the pictures in the bait shop, but there's no really footage. There's no coverage besides minimal mom and pop coverage of it. So we thought it'd be a cool idea to get you and us out here to basically show off what's out here, essentially, and show off what can be done. When you drive in and you see how much bigger this area is than the pictures and the videos, it kind of, I mean, it's exactly what we wanted. Something where you're in the middle of nowhere, um, you kind of feel like you're off the beaten path, kind of like you're elk hunting, kind of like you're on an adventure, um, but you're in a nice little town where you can catch big lakers on a nice lake. So I'm laying them all nice in here neatly, and it'll be a big frickin' rat mess by the time we get there in the morning. Morning bite for small fish, and now Cade, just doing Cade things, just hooked up with a big one. What we hope. Yeah, it's fighting a lot bigger than other ones, right? Wow. Yeah. This yeah. one hurts. <laughs> <laughs> On the fall. A little bit of rough water today. Uh, we donated a uh, one rod to the lake, and this one was back in the transom, so that must mean good luck today, right? And so I came out here kind of with the same impression that we've always done where, you know, you got a group of guys that just split up. Everybody goes out and tries to get onto a bite. We try to communicate with each other and, and try to help each other out and get on, on the same bite. The way that these guys do it though with Active Target, it's a whole different ball game. Getting the engineers, get Josh, 
get um, a whole crew into the boat and show them exactly how we fish. It's kind of like a video game. So they get in and they can do things and see things that they've never seen before and they can interact with the fish throughout that whole process. It just makes it a more memorable experience. I mean, you just get to have more fun. I'm gonna try to drain it. Anything else? No, that's it. So if I had to describe Flathead Lake, I would say that this is a little lake superior from the water quality. I mean, it's a, it's a cold, deep lake, super clear, but it's sitting right in the mountain. So if you can take Lake Superior and then drop it into a mountain range, um, that's basically what you have. Being able to take a group of guys who all share the same interests, who all are involved in aqua traction, I mean, we're a family. It's I don't get to hang out with the engineers much. Um, obviously I work with them, work side by side with them. Um, but being able to do these personal experiences, personal fishing trips is, I mean, it's, we're living a dream. There's not much else to say. So there, there's a certain point where things kind of transition in your mind from going on a fishing trip and just worried about catching fish to really sitting back and embracing the whole entire experience that's taking place. You know, I've got employees that I, I, I see them every single day and they bust their ass, they work hard for me, they work hard for aqua tractions. It's just the, the coolest experience just to be able to see these guys come out, have a good time, big smiles, catch the biggest fish they've ever caught in their life, taking those great photos, going back and have just awesome memories of this, this trip out here to Montana. I've met Tanner and Kate a couple times, never met Keeve, and it's just been a blast out here with these guys. The level of energy that everyone has is just freaking contagious. It's fun. First off, I wanted to say I appreciate you guys, every single one of you. Super happy to be associated with every single one of you guys. I appreciate everything that you guys do. Had a great time this week. Thank you. Hey, Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. 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 Winner's ceremony. So we're gonna start with the smallest fish and it was a brutal tie <laughs> between two 19 inchers, Alex and Adam. The determined winner, line them up boys. All right, ready? Go. Oh! with the smallest fish award. <laughs> Woo! The world of pride. Here we are. Then, for the biggest fish award, Aqua Tractions project engineer Alex comes in and completely demolishes oh, everybody. everybody. Congratulations, Thank Alex. Yeah. All right, guys. Awesome. Thank you. Hey, thank you. I had a great Thank you, Thanks, boys. Yeah. Thank you, guys.